after Bradley's crash, we've got all the guys to refocus and say, let's go on the attack, let's get out there and show that we're not just going to, you know, disappear. We want to animate this race and have a great race, albeit a different type of break. So Zabby got in the break on the first day after Bradley's crash. Fletcher then attacked near the end. It was, you know, quite animated with him and Vinokur off, you know, great racing. And then yesterday we felt, yeah, it's definitely a stage for Fletcher. We're confident that uh, everybody knew. I mean, you know, could have put an advertisement on the telly that uh, Vodka was going to go yesterday. Um, and so he managed to work hard to get in the break. It got established, and he thought, God, this is going to go all the way, and he's got a great chance of a stage one. So for that then to be taken away unnecessarily, I think he had a very different kind of emotional reaction on the team. And then that was like, wow, you know, that's that, that was that's a different type of a blow. But <clears throat> they're a tight team, and I think they've um, they've refocused and. Um, you know, they feel really sorry for Fletcher. You know, they just think, well, hold on, that, that shouldn't have happened. Um, but what they will do is keep going out there on the front foot. I spend a little bit the morning in the hospital, making x rays, clean the wounds, and everything. I got a pretty swollen elbow. We were scared and concerned that it was broken, but it's all fine. It was a, it's a big hit, bone hit, and then. Uh, on my knee I got a hole, which is hard to stitch, so I only got one stitch just to, because I need, they need to leave it open, just let the, the body heal it properly, from inside to outside, so, so yeah, I'm pretty sore actually, and on my back I got blushers and wounds everywhere, but uh, yeah, I would like to continue, I was enjoying so much this race, what else I can do in July? <laughs> It's a painful area of the elbow where the doctor was more concerned mm -hmm. and was looking good and was looking like no fracture, no, no crack. So let's see, let's see how, how, how they evolve, of course. I mean, it's quite soon, I just let's see it day by day and, and, and heal as soon as possible. My reaction is um, to try and establish the facts of what happened. Um, once we have those facts then we can look at what options we are available to us and then we can decide whether we want to pursue any of those options or not but at the moment we're working with ASO I think it's an important not to get too emotional about it we, we, we you know working behind closed doors with the ASO uh, like I say to establish those facts and then we can decide how we want to pursue it